So A2. Wonder why she's wanted. Guess we just kill all the androids who try to escape your hoe or whatever. So drop down by the save point? I mean like off this cliff? If you say so. Actually I don't know, should I trust you? I can move my camera a little down to see. Oh, it's a push type of deal. I see. And I can't push it though. Can't jump over it either. Did I just block my path? I think I did. Uh oh, I hope not. Oh, I can pull it. Ooh, that's good. Thought I could only push these things. When I was doing that one puzzle in the back of the resistance camp, I couldn't remember being able to pull it. Forest blacksmith. I'm a blacksmith. Masumun. Masumun. See, you're taking good care of your weapons. However, I'd be happy to sharpen them. Ooh. Upgrade, and I don't have enough. I need three more warped wire. Huh, what do you sell? Machine sword, machine axe, and a machine spear. I don't know, I don't think I need any of these just yet. Maybe I'll come back later. My master honed that very blade long ago. Really? Gathered four black and four white weapons and improved on them, but they spilled so much blood that my master sealed them away from in various locations across the world. However, I wager you would wield them in the service of good. If that is true, you can search for them in sealed shrines. Huh, okay. Sealed shrines? And those like those areas with the chains holding it shut? Okay, now how do I get back up though? That's the question. Uh, I was hoping I didn't have to do this. The 20 minute time to pull it across. Hoping I could just jump up. Well, there, time to fight the boss one more time. Let's save first. I do not want to have to pull that box a second time. A2, I'm going to kill you. Uh oh, she summoned her minions. So she just killed the forest king like it was nothing. I guess it was a little baby looking creature. A helpless little machine and she ran it through with a sword. Retrieve, which one's my body? I guess there's like a whole pile of bodies right here. One of them's got to be mine. Wait, if the only smith to forge level 4. Does that mean I'm getting near the end of the game then if it's already the most upgrading people possible? I don't want to see the baby machine die. The forest king. No, don't kill him. A2. Do all the androids have pretty much the same face? Their king? Like if B2. 2B. <laughs> 2B took off her mask, would she have the same looking face as A2? Would they be like identical twins and she has only this one has long hair? How closely did they make the machines to or the androids to resemble each other? I doubt they come up with a completely unique design be, for every single one. That's an android. A Yorha type android. I guess there could be this unit is differences. Like maybe there's a ton of 2B units out there. Annihilation? But why? Let's go, 9S. To be! <laughs> you got a giant sword. No, what the heck? To be and 9S, we've picked up a signal from the black box of a fugitive known as A2. 
What you see in front oh wow, I do my heavy attack and drop down right when she attacks. <laughs> but she's, okay, I didn't want to have to use these. Us. Now kill her <laughs> really she that kills fast? You. Already dead, Mahendo. You're a very smart person. You know what you're talking about. Okay, third try. Maybe I need to stop using the movement speed chips and use like actual combat ones. So I don't really need to be moving around too much in a fight. Just dodging and stuff, but I don't know if any of that gets faster with upgrades. Oh wow, more of them. It's gonna take forever to even get to the boss. Ooh! Ouch! Leave me alone, I'm friendly! Is this never ending? Okay, if I die here before I recover my body, I better take one of these just in case. I'm sorry when 9S woke her up. Yeah, but that was so long ago. So what, are your, is your hell like the... The whatever thing that the humans made, or are there like multiple companies that produce androids? Or is that just like the name that the humans gave all the androids to fight the machines? Why would they say they're Yorha every time? I guess maybe there's like generic models that are like the resistance people, and then there's the Yorha that are like the high tech upgraded ones or something. Let's change my plug in chips. So it says I have 12% of these, I wonder. I can get more. Wait, what the heck? Are my upgrades not on? Or no, I'm completely full. I think. No, I'm not. What the heck? Where did all my chips go? Did I take them all off? I don't know, because I died. No wonder. So if you die twice and lose all your chips, does that mean they actually get deleted and you gotta rebuy them all? No, I can't. Oh, I got. I had to get too close. I activated the thing before I could recover my body. Come on, let me get my chips. I don't want to have to rebuy them. They what were expensive. This? Their king. At least I can skip it. To be. That's an android. No crap, it is. Now let me get my chips. Android. Alert! This unit is currently wanted by Yorha. Annihilation recommended. Annihilation? But why? Let's go, 9S. 9S, don't worry about things like that. Just kill her. That's not mine. Wait, yeah, I guess it is. It gave me a weird name. Heck yeah, I leveled up. Wait a minute, I was leveled up already. And it reset. Bunker to 2B and 9S. We've picked up a signal from the black box of a fugitive known as A2. What you see in front of you is your enemy. I couldn't that time because my body was like right when my character started auto walking. She destroyed multiple pursuit androids. Now kill her before she kills you. Hmm. Wish I could change my chips mid battle. And then I could add my combat ones that I want to use. Holy crap, she's fast. No, don't kill me! Hey, this fight's going a little better than the last time. What was that explosion? She sure makes a lot of noises when she attacks or gets hit or something. Uh oh. Better take a health potion just in case. 
I'm never forgetting to shoot my pod. Ouch! Guess that was it. Bag, then she just mysteriously Why? stands there. Why did you betray us? Command is the one that betrayed you. Did she realize the truth that machines aren't all evil and that command Let's is just trying to beef. get us to kill them all? The mystery continues, but it seems like it's beginning to unfold. Whee! She's gone. There had to be a way to get a softer landing. Operator, this is 9S. Patch me through to the commander. Roger that, 9S. I'm sorry, commander. We failed to defeat the fugitive. I see. Well, at least you're both safe. That's an incredibly powerful unit you just faced. Yeah, we can tell. keep your distance in the future. Commander, why did A2 desert the force? <sighs> I'm afraid that's classified. Oh? Huh. To be. Like yeah. how Ninus Let's go ask spins too. He might know something. All right. Move so stiff during times like that. Um, Pascal. Steam achievement, this mechanical kingdom. Oh, you survived! How wonderful! Yeah, we're fine. But there's something we want to ask you about. Of course, anything. Actually, it needs to be in person. Hmm. Understood. I'll open the gate we built to deter enemy invaders. You'll be able to reach the village through there. Finally, the shortcut is open. <laughs> so the enemy invaders, are they also machines? Are they the jungle machines? Machine versus machine? I better save. Quick save. There. Jump. So when you do your second playthrough, are all the enemies way tougher or do they or do the enemies scale to your level anyway? You can fall from the roof you land on after the prologue. The roof you land on. You're talking about when we flew down from the bunker? Or the prologue? When was that? The factory? That must be the gate Pascal opened for us. Yeah, it is open, finally. Wait, it's not even open yet. Oh, hello, gatekeeper. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, let's go talk to Pascal. We were calling a Pascal after being used to like the Intel processor name of like Pascal or whatever. You got an egg? Yeah, whatever happened to that forest king, it just flung off her sword and was never to be seen again. Funny how machines have different levels of like intellect or something. Or whatever. Those ones are more like tribally type of warrior types, and these ones are more friendly village. And... Hello, Pascal. I'm surprised you wish to speak with me personally. Whatever is the matter. It'll be fast. Yeah, if we you just take a look at this recording. Transfer data. I see. Information about this A2 android is indeed contained within our archives. We all understand her to be rather dangerous. However, she's never visited our village in person. My apologies. That's all the information I have. The I see. heck? All right, thanks. Let's stay sharp and head back to the resistance camp. We should run a check on our consciousness data and resupply. Our consciousness data. Well, hey, I can fast travel now, so 
No more walking back and forth. But I kind of like walking back and forth for some reason. Oh, well, whatever. Let's just fast travel. Maybe it'll be better for the stream anyway, so that I'm not running for five minutes and choppy frame rates and all that. This maybe would have been faster though with this long loading screen. 9S, why did you ask Pascal about A2? Huh? It's not recommended to interface with machines without consulting command. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Though See, I he's starting to break the rules. Can be admirable in its own way. <laughs> Thanks. He's starting to, to break the rules Still, to be communicate with machines. Enemy. Don't forget it. You've got mail? Oh, yes. I better check my mailbox. Hand it over the forest Operator photo. Just one more to go. That was the waterfall in the forest. I guess I stumbled onto it one day when I was lost. But how did I get there in the first place? Yeah, seriously. With all the ways to it closed? I guess you went across that bridge and somehow got access to the thing. Maybe the gate there was open or something. Oh, 2B. Your timing is impeccable. Our android forces currently have a carrier deployed in the Pacific Ocean. It should be back here to resupply before too long. The Resistance is assisting with the mission, so I'd like to ask you to run a little guard duty. Seriously? Dead serious. There's a stockpile of missiles down at the shoreline that needs to be loaded on the carrier. And with all the machine activity lately, we need to stay on our toes. Of course, if you're already working on something for Yorha, I don't mind if that takes priority. Anyway... Thanks in advance. Pacific Ocean? Where does this game take place? And there are a lot of JRPGs like this. When the characters, like Dark Souls even. The characters talk but nobody's mouth moves. I'll take your quest. I kind of am working on something for your host. Oh, your time is excellent. I need a favor from you both. What is it? We're planning a recon expedition in the forest region. But before we can start, we need someone to head in there and set up a satellite camp. The enemies are tough and I'd lose a lot of good people if we tried to clear them out, but you two seem like you can handle yourselves, so... Got it. Head to the woods and clear out any enemies. That's the long and short of it, yes. Thank you. Okay. So Adam and Eve are in a class of their own. It's weird they're called Adam and Eve and they're both dudes. Or as, as far as androids or, or I guess robots go. So I guess that one area that I couldn't get to in the desert must have been where that final all, photo is. But these resistance types sure do use and abuse us, don't they? It's like they see us as a couple of gophers or something. No complaining about your work. Exchanging information with the resistance is a vital part of our mission. Besides, the heck I can climb up the robot? Is safer than being locked in combat all the time. Not dying beats dying any day. Yeah, that's true. It's weird how these are like the exact design of the one we climbed up. Wait, maybe this is the one we climbed. That like the factory thing we climbed up in the prologue. Just because I assume the one that we fought in the factory was the one that we climbed up earlier, but maybe it was a different one. Man, that texture was bad on the underside of the whatever that is. They're from your huh? Alert. Targets what the are heck? units 22B and 64B, currently designated for detention. Um. They've come for us, idiot! Prepare to engage and inform the captain! Uh, Why does it seem like all the resistance people who aren't with Yorha have Disengage and surrender immediately. a lot more personality than the trap. Yorha ones? Except 9S, maybe. Maybe the... Maybe the Yorha really are evil and keeping stuff from us. So these are both B units, both combat units. I wonder what A units are. So if B are like combat or something, maybe. That A, whatever, A2 or whatever she was called, was pretty tough. These are like 22B and whatever. I don't know if I should change 9S's AI to be aggressive, because it just, when I had him on aggressive for a little while there, he did so much more damage in the fights. Wait, they have a captain? Hey, where are you going? 
What the heck? Is my targeting still on him? I guess I can they got away climb up here. They didn't get away. We could chase them, 9S. Okay, no, we can't. We can't climb up this. Wait, can we? No, an invisible wall. Oh, that was close. Can you go to the room next to the resistance camp save point? The one that they gave me access to? My bedroom? I think so. Let's go see. Talk about this room. See how much I need to upgrade my weapon to level 3. Still need 3 warped wires. wonder how I get warped wire. Cause my weapon will be hitting so hard if I can get that. A means assault, B means battle, S means scanner, and O means operator. Yeah, I figured O. It's all the operators are O whatever. So I'm a type 2 battle unit, she's a type 2 assault unit, and he's a type 9. Or I guess we should just start calling him 9s like you asked. So do I gotta talk to this robot thing? Wait, is that- Yes, he's finally there! The guy who goes in circles! I could do the race again! I wonder why it took him so long to appear. Because before I died, when I forgot to save... He was here before. Funny how he talks about, oh, life is too short to be wasting going in circles or whatever, but that's all he does. Now let's have a race that will make our very souls quiver with delight. Yes, let's quiver. An excellent response. Okay, I can't lose now that I got a 20% speed boost. Wait a minute. Oh, I guess... I thought I forgot to save, but I guess the first race did save. Huh. Maybe that's why I didn't appear. Maybe he was waiting at the finish line. That's kind of what I wonder, but I don't remember exactly how to get to the finish line. Holy crap, that 20% speed boost made a huge difference. 20% difference, in fact. Not bad, you're getting closer to becoming a true speedster. Keep it up, I want us to grow even faster together. I'll be here whenever you're ready to try me again. Well, that one's still pretty close. Well, let's try the next one. Hello, 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 hello. Feel it in my core. Today is the day we pursue the ultimate in speed. Is this the final one? We should break down all barriers. Sound light, tacky, and never doubt your true potential. Let's do it. Ahaha, ah, today we show the world what it means to be speed itself. I don't know about that. Who the heck are you, O9S? Here we go. Glorious goals just over there. Well, how do I get to there? I guess this one's gonna be about finding a path that gets me there faster. I guess I could just go around maybe. I think I just wasted so much time doing that. At least it's a pretty smooth area that I could just run straight the whole time. And get my maximum excel- No way can I beat this. Okay. This one's gonna be tough. 
Maybe I gotta try the other way around. Maybe that's like the longer way or something. Pretty even though. Loading map? What the heck is this? Okay, I guess this time I'll try going this way. Jump straight down. And run it. Okay, yeah, I didn't. I tried to press A, but I guess I used my double jump already or something. I like when 2B is moving at top speed. Her footsteps are like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. What the heck? All oh, the plants stopped me. Well, I'm losing this one for sure. Wait, where's the finish line? That's not the finish line. Okay, I got so confused right there. Yeah, I think I speed boosted again and stopped my jump or something. Oh, what am I doing? I don't even know which way I'm going. What the? Oh, okay, I'm losing again for sure. Hold jump for a good landing. Okay, fourth time's the charm. I think I hit the boost button. So yeah, if you're doing that free fall, it's like you can't get the soft landing or something. Because I was holding A after I did that. Yeah, I'm losing this one. Is there a way to just restart right from the menu? No, it doesn't look like it. Maybe it's because I go out the building without jumping that doesn't activate the actual jump to double jump or something. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that one wasn't it either, but that time it let me double jump in the air at least. That would let me double jump in the air. Even if I just accelerated off the edge of the building and didn't actually jump off, but I guess not.
Yeah, what the heck? I thought you said I could dodge in the air and then it would slow me down. I thought I could, but it's not letting me now. So what, if you do the double jump, then you can't dodge this in the air? I don't know, I'm all confused with this movement system. I haven't had to move a lot of these ways, but now I'm suddenly having to do it for the race. Hold the jump button. What do you mean? Like where I do the slow fall? Because even if I hold it, then it doesn't do that. Unless I get the right jump off the building, which then I gotta like pause at the beginning of the race just to get that jump. Yeah, that slow fall will take a lot of time out of the race too. Play it on keyboard and mouse. Oopsie, I just bumped the microphone. Yeah, like right there. I jumped, but apparently it didn't count it because then I couldn't double jump in the air after I already jumped once. I know it's, it'd be a lot easier if it started like in the middle of the building, not right at the edge of it. Because then I, because if I speed boost to get a fast start, then I go off the building before it actually can jump, and then it doesn't work. Did I win that time? I don't know. There. Fine. Dented plate. No, I need a wire so I can upgrade my weapon. Moving speed up plus three. Oh, heck yeah. That's what I need. Strange. I thought it'd be sad, but instead I feel peace. When I think back on how competitive I was before, it seems so very ugly. That was my life, and thus I own it. I'm content. 2 is like, ah, uh, yeah, okay. What? <laughs> he kills himself? Is that if they become content and happy with everything or like okay with everything then they suddenly get killed? That was messed up. Why'd he die? What the heck? This one died too? The guy who was like the finish line one? Wait, was that machine the one who said what's up with that guy and then he killed himself too? I'm so confused. What's with these machines and killing themselves? Customize, equip chips, let's do all chips. So movement speed up by 8. Some plus 3 will either be 12 or be take up less slots. Okay, let's remove this one, remove this one, and remove this one. Are you serious? Only 10%? Well, then there's no way to get it even 20 unless I get a second plus 3 chip. And look how much space this one takes up. Well, this sucks. I was hoping it would be 12 percent because then I could use the plus 2. I guess I need to find another plus 3 chip if I want to get an even 20. I'm going to have to go back to using 3 plus 4s again. I know it like, takes up a crap ton of space, but at least it gets it to exactly 20. Another drop right up, maybe. Whatever, I guess I'll only be 18% boosted. Recover health for every enemy defeated. 30%, that could be good, but usually when I get low, it's in a boss fight when there's not any enemies to defeat. I don't worry about that then. Over 10% of damage dealt is HP. Okay, that one could be really good. Just short. Guess I'll have to go back and do the optimize thing. Maybe take a couple out which ones don't i need i need that one xp gauge i don't think i need but it takes up so little space that i might as well keep it mini map i need objectives i 
Don't even know where to list my objectives, I guess. Is that on the minimap? Have you unlocked chipsets B and C yet? I don't know, have I? What's the benefit to using these ones? Or how do I switch? I could just switch them in battle so I can have one for moving around and switch it to one for mid battle. Offensive heal is OP. Maybe I'll have to use that one then. Turn invincible. I don't need both of these. Look at the plus three, it only takes up seven. The plus one takes 11. No wonder I'm so inefficient on my space and don't even need that. Auto heal. I don't think I need both auto heals. Do they stack? I, I assume they do. Another auto heal plus one. So two auto heal plus ones. Yeah, no, I don't need that much health regen. How do you switch between? Do I have to go in my menu every time or is there like a key that just automatically or like quickly switches it? Evade range, 60%. That is hacked. Forgot I had this one equipped. I was looking and I saw the one that raises it by like whatever other percent. Yeah, I don't think I need all these auto heals. Auto heal. I'll just use this one. I don't think I want to waste this much space to, just for 10% drop rate increase. Weapon attack up. Don't even have those equipped. Okay, let's optimize. A lot of new space available. Okay, so how to use item I don't need. Drop rate up, movement plus three I do want. Wait. The effect has been reached, okay. Yeah, 3 dot keeps letting me stack them all. Yeah, so I just want those to remove this one, remove this one. I don't know, drop right up. I guess I'll keep it. Just hard deciding, because I don't know if I want combat ones. 5% chance of reviving, I don't need. Auto heal, I already have. Deadly heal. Yeah, I'll do that offensive heal. Look at it. Five times increase in the amount you heal. And it takes up less. Whatever. Slots, anyway. Max HP up, I don't think I need. Turn invincible, I already have one equipped. Anti, yeah, anti-chain. I think mine's for two seconds. So the ones with diamonds, didn't you say the ones with diamonds next to them are good? Increases power projectile attacks. Critical up. 1% though, that's not a lot. This is tough to decide what I want. That control one I might not need, but again, it takes up so little amount that why wouldn't I? Okay, any important ones? I didn't see any important ones. Maybe I'll just add another drop rate one or something. Fast cooldown. Eh, might as well. Ooh, that's too big. Max HP up.
Just enough, might as well. Don't have anything else I really care about. Down attack up, increase the power of down attacks. Weapon attack up. Yeah, I think I'm pretty happy with what I have. I don't know what else would be worth using. One more optimization. Okay. Good to go. Ouch. So I gotta open these. What the heck? Where did you guys come from? Whatever that shock adds a slightly weak shock on attack. I wonder how weak it is exactly. It's even worth using at all. I feel like I do quite a bit of damage. The enemies are only level 15 though. The weapon set you do. The weapon set? No, I don't want to change that. Oh, I only see weapon set. How do you change the chipset okay, where am I going here Looked like the main quest thing was pointing here, but I guess not. Man, there's not even any pickups in here, it looks like. Okay, I guess I'm heading back. What the heck? Did I go the wrong way or something? No, it's a dead end. I haven't figured out how to hack into that yet. Maybe soon I'll be able to. And then I can go back to the factory and hopefully hack into those doors that are locked. Saving is possible. Well, I don't think I need to save. Just did a second ago. The heck, Pyramid Head is here. Near from Death Note Automotive. You're right about that. I can't remember which one he was. You see that nerdy looking L replacement some machines little so kid guy? While others couldn't care less about us. So many things to pick up. Okay, it looks like the quest is pointing here. Maybe it's like above me. Or maybe not. Missile supply. What the heck? The thing just changed. I didn't even read what it said. It disappeared before I could. Okay, let's head back. The little kid guy. <laughs> yeah. That show got so bad as soon as L died, though. He was the only good character. It's 
So wait, is the quest in the resistance camp? Is it Pascal's village? It looks like it's Pascal's village. Okay, let's save and get out of here. Transport. The path is lower. What path? In that tunnel thing? No, it's not Pascal. I wish you could see. Wait, can you see quests on this map? I see that one red circle. Near factory. Bunker. <laughs> classified. Whatever, let's see what's that Pascal's village. I guess this one doesn't look like a vending machine. Not as much anyway. Any quests here? Are you serious? Doesn't look like it. A good custom zombies. What the heck are you trolling about this time? Transport. This isn't a custom zombies map, you troll liar. Let's go back down here. Get back to the pit. If you say so. 